So next segment, what we decided to do here, or what I decided to do, sorry for the crooked video. Um, I'm gonna use my other high box for shaker box to shake it into this other box. So, like this, get that off. Okay, I'm just gonna take this frame, and these, and it's gonna go. There is not much going on in here. Smoke and get a little crazy. You pick up one sting so far, but very minor. Didn't get very deep, very long. Remember, we're looking for one frame to keep. Here. And they got some nectar. Not the best one. I'm looking for eggs. At the same time, I'm expecting to see probably the best empty frame so far. There's a little bit of pollen going on in there. But I'm looking for eggs just to make sure I don't see any. All right, last frame in this box. The bees in this box are flipped. Oh, where's everybody? Hey. Excuse me, girlies. I'm going to reunite you with your kin. Yeah. It's a good plan. I'm going to have to find me a good frame to bring back over here. Empty, empty. I ain't sure there's queen in here. But we'll see. So now, this box. Queen's not right here. I don't see her.
a little bit smaller today. The weekend. tricky part. Get these bees down and get this box back on there. So not too bad actually. There. There we go. I hope that wasn't too ugly. I'm not gonna worry about this other frame till I find a good one to put in here. Uh, yeah, maybe I'll pick the best one for now. Go with what I got. these again. I don't think any of these are any good though. Yeah, it's got a little bit of pollen nectar they were working on. Tempted. Wasn't so late I just pour some syrup on there. Nothing. They were working a little something. They were working a little something there. Alright, I'm satisfied. I think I'll just freeze these. And hopefully, I'll probably just give them back a honey frame that I was going to extract. I've got two cap frames. I'll probably give them one. And just call it a harvest. Done. we do that well one all those frames were empty except for maybe if I took it all together maybe one side of one frame half so nothing so there's an empty space for beetles and moths and mice and mites and whatever else and then a lot more space to keep warm so now every single one of those frames in there either has brood, honey, or pollen in their short one frame. And I'm going to drop a uh, feeder frame in all these and give them uh, little sugar cakes and, uh, and then just monitor that through the winter. Um, as opposed to doing a camp method, which I think just sucks moisture and then drips moisture. I've also made, well, another video, but a, a big block of sugar. But they don't go through it, so that's too much. So I have some plans. Anyway, on to the next yard, but that's gonna that's gonna hold them for now. Thanks for watching.